Hey guys, what's up? It's Jonathan with One Big Impact. So we're actually starting our day on the treadmill. If I can figure out how to start this thing, it's really dark over here. Um, it's, whoa, it's not as cool as some people's scales that they sent me, Debbie. <laughs> um, so today is Monday, happy Monday, first of all. And I hope it's not too super loud for you not to be able to hear me over this. I'm gonna talk, talk kind of loud. Um, but I want you to get at the minimum today. Today's going to be kind of a relaxed day. I don't want you to go too crazy. It's Monday, but I want you to start with cardio because it just generally makes you feel a lot better. So one hour of cardio. Now, I don't want to be doing this. I know what you're going through. Trust me. You're like, man, it's Monday. I don't want to be. Personally, I love Mondays because it's like fresh start. You can't. You know, you got a whole week and you're going to kill this week and I'm a morning person, so you may not be and I understand that completely, um, but sometimes, you know, cardio sucks and we get that, but it's probably the best lifeblood that you can do to be able to keep your heart, your lungs, your body, your circulation, everything healthy and it's really important. Like Ron says, you know, you got to get your laps in, you got to get those uh, 10,000 steps per day. Now I don't want you to be counting this against your 10,000 steps. This is just in addition to each and everything that you're doing currently. Now you don't have to walk on a treadmill. You can walk you know, around the neighborhood. A lot of the times that's a lot easier uh, because you're seeing sights and stuff like that. You're not having to worry about um, you know, sitting here looking at the clock forever. You can just casually look at your watch or you, know, you can time it one time. You know, Walk for an hour and then you know your path and you can walk that path every day and you can actually be able to get uh, more time knocked out quicker. So you can cycle, I don't care if you want a bike, uh, you can run, you can get on the elliptical, you can do whatever you want. Just today, on Monday, I want you to do an hour. I'd love if you could post a picture of you guys doing your cardio today, because that's really important. The second thing, right when you wake up, I want you to drink a bottle of water each and every morning. Every morning each and every single morning first thing before your coffee before anything there goes my pen uh, the second thing or the third thing is if it's hot go early or go late I'm in Arizona that's why actually why I'm doing it inside I don't like like to wake up sweating um, I like to uh, let's say I would rather live in the Arctic tundra than live in Arizona <laughs> I would I love the cold. Um, it's probably because I live in the heat, but some of you may understand that. It looks like we did the roll call the other day and we actually have a lot of members that are in the Arizona. So please be super careful if you're going out there and getting uh, your exercise that you do it either really early in the morning, right about now, it's like five, just before the sun comes up, <coughs> or late at night after the sun goes down. If you do it during the day, Please go with a buddy. Make sure you're not overworking yourself. Uh, bring, bring plenty of water, like a camel pack or whatever. Make sure you bring one of those. The next thing is to take your vitamins when you start your day. It's Monday. Get your vitamins right. Uh, nice vitamin D. Uh, if you're exercising a lot, maybe a glucosamine supplement uh, for your joints. Uh, to Basically like hydraulic fluid for your joints. Uh, it gives you a nice amount of lubrication between your joints and everything as well as a multivitamin, um, fish oil is a, another good one. As Crystal says, fiber, I do, I do a fiber supplement. Um, so just make sure you're getting those. Uh, magnesium zinc is a good one too. But you know, don't go crazy on vitamins because like eating tons of vitamin C and stuff like that is not gonna help you stop from getting sick. What's gonna help you stop from getting sick is, is exercising, drinking lots of water, being active, um, and li living a positive lifestyle. Uh, the, number, the, the number five thing is remember how insanely amazing you are. You have to remember that. that. That's number five. Just remember how awesome you are and remember what you're doing is creating a freaking beautiful future for yourself. Sometimes we get wrapped up in, oh my gosh, I got to work out. I got to do this with the kids. I got to go to school. I got to go to PTO meetings. I got to do this. Oh my God. And just stop. Take this hour to realize how fantastic you are as a person. You guys, keep up the good work. This is day four of the challenge. I'm about to do my hour. I got 
55 minutes left. So I'm going to make a couple videos. You're probably going to see me on this treadmill today. Uh, but they're going to be separate videos. So keep up the good work. I'd love to have you comment in the section below. Once you do your car cardio, tell me what you did. Tell me what you did. I'd love to see creative stuff. You guys have a beautiful day. Keep up the good work. And remember to hashtag be stronger than your excuses. And remember to spread love, not hate. Peace, guys.